guys, thanks for clicking the link. Welcome back. Some of you might know that I did a one stick fire challenge video. And uh, I challenged a couple of buddies of mine to it. They are all for it. They're getting those done. And uh, Dark Steel actually got his done and uh, in response. So I will have him linked up here. Definitely check him out. We are here today because of that video. SC Bushcraft Backwoods. Okay, awesome channel. Uh, also will be linked up here and in the description. Gave me a challenge based off of my one stick fire challenge. Okay, it's called the one handed one stick fire challenge. So, uh, a little bit harder using a ferro rod one handed. Uh, there's not many rules to it guys, uh, except that I can only use one hand. So, yeah. All right, let's get to it. All right, guys. So, what we have, I'm trying to stay in frame. I'm not sure how far in or out I am right now. I got my camera turned around got tinder tin from exotac awesome awesome company guys i might use that here in a little bit um i shouldn't have to but we're gonna test it out i am gonna use my uh fatwood stick that i won from the uh bushcraft gathering from Bombproof bushcraft guys y'all have got to check her out she is awesome so we got that right here on top of it, just to keep it going, all we're really going to use is just some little stuff that I'm picking up off the ground, right? Okay. Um, Alright. And we are going to do this challenge, and it is one-handed, right? Not two hands. So, uh, for the remainder of this challenge, let's see. I also have... forgot my main <laughs> ignition source my fire steel from uh, firesteel.com check them out as well uh, and uh, I did not bring it again the wazoo gear guys the wazoo necklace fire necklace I'm gonna do a video on that very soon uh, but I have them linked as well in the description so check their stuff out uh, I actually became an affiliate of theirs through the, the bushcraft gathering. So uh, use my link and it actually helps my channel out. So, all right guys, got all my tools here lined up, right? Got one hand, just gonna keep in my pocket, okay? Got my little base, okay? All right, it is a little bit wobbly. So, let's see if I can do it on this side and see if y'all can see it. I'm trying to keep me in focus, guys, so everybody knows I'm not cheating on this. Basically, I'm just going to make some curls out of this fat wood. Okay. guys and this kind of scenario right here would be for if you're injured um, anything like that you always want to plan just in case okay um, you want to be able to make sure you're not stuck on one way of surviving right you want to make sure you have more than one option um, 
and you're not stuck, oh, I can only do this with my right hand, oh, I can only do this with my left hand. You want to be able to do it under any circumstance, okay? This is fat wood, so it's actually a pretty good pile. Um, and my knife started slipping there, so I'm going to attempt to light this up. Here comes the hard part. That was actually the easy part. Um, get all the shavings I can possibly get in here, guys. Okay. Any that have dropped off. Um, All right, so now I'm gonna stick this in here, right? I'm gonna hold it and balance it as much as humanly possible with my knee, okay? Because I'm one-handed, I can't do what I normally do. Cannot do what I normally do here. So I want to, I'm actually going to try and do it as straight up and down as humanly possible and hope this catches. Okay. And it's fat wood. It shouldn't take long to catch. Um, he did not have any specific rules on how long this was supposed to go. Um, I'm actually going to get it going from... Uh, this tinder to some kindling and see how long I can I can get it going. See if I can burn it off a decent decent amount for about 10 seconds or so. So get it balanced on my knee the right way. Alright, got that going. Okay. Like I said, guys, it's fat wood, so it should burn for a considerable amount of time, right? And that should give you time to run around, grab up some more stuff. Okay? And let it burn into a nice ember, right? I got the uh, lawnmower back. But y'all see the, the whole point? All I used was a little bit of this fat wood. All right, guys. As you can see, and as you can hear, the lawnmowers got in our way. Uh, they just kept getting closer and closer, drowning me out. So, here we are. Um, basically, all I was trying to explain, guys, that's all I used was that fat wood stick to get it going, get it really, really kicked up. Grabbed up some stuff from around where I was sitting, put it on the fire, and uh, you can kind of continue that process if you were in a situation like that. So, what I do want to know is what you guys think. Um, if you have any challenges that you'd like to, to give me to do, uh, leave those down in the comments, guys. Um, start it out as challenge so that I can, I can definitely see it and tag it as a challenge for me. Um, and... I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate I appreciate SC Bushcraft uh, giving me this challenge. You guys go check him out. Link will be down in the description. And that's about all I got, guys. Um, it was a great time out. It was a great challenge to do. So I had a good time. And I hope you guys enjoy it. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And yeah, that's all I got, guys. Um, until next time, thanks for watching, and we'll see you later.